Hi everyone. Um, so today we are flying to Nashville. Um, I'm getting ready to go to LAX for the first time because I'm a little bitch and chose Orange County because it's like the tiniest airport ever. There's like five gates. It's like, oh, you're white? Go on through. You're fine. Don't even worry about security. Just how Orange County is. I'm not being racist. I'm being funny. So calm the fuck down. Um, it's five o'clock in the morning and I'm already making like racial statements. I don't understand how to live my life. Anyway, we are going to Nashville and it's exciting and I can't wait to get there and we're going to eat a fried okra and yeah. So when I get there, I'll do another video. I'll probably do another video clip in LAX like when I'm eating chickpeas with cinnamon and drinking coffee that I need desperately. So um, my cab's almost here and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, so I, I decided that I'm going to start vlogging. It's kind of a thing that's been on my mind. I think it's going to be a good form of therapy for me. I haven't introduced myself to anybody. The people who see this already know me. Um, but I am an art director and we're in Nashville right now. We're doing a photo shoot tomorrow. And we just checked in to the Thompson Hotel in the Arts District. It's downtown. And this is the coolest fucking hotel room slash hotel I've ever been to in my life. I've been in Nashville for like three seconds. The baristas at the coffee shop downstairs, one of the guys is from Pittsburgh. They're the nicest fucking humans on the planet. They messed up my matcha order because they thought it was, they, it had cane sugar already in it and I like freaked out for a second. They wanted to give me a full refund to give me cold brew. I paid for it anyway, but the fact that they offered that this guy opened the hotel door for me and then kept the elevator open and hit seven and we had a long conversation about his badass green suede adidas shoes everyone here is fucking perfect and when i got up into my hallway i heard this lady knock on a door and she said bar service and that's the most beautiful thing ever so nashville has already won my heart it feels like ohio it's green it's beautiful but this hotel room guys so I'm so obsessed with this fucking hotel room. So you you walk in, obviously, and then, hold on. Oh my god, wait. I wanna, can I, this fucking bathroom. I need to like switch this. Can I turn the orientation? No, you can't fucking turn the orientation. Hold on. You'd think as a designer I'd have a fucking bath. So look at this. Can you see? Look at the floor, what? Like, seriously, the most fucking badass place I've ever been to. And the, the people downstairs said that the interior designer um, is from L.A., so they have good style. But look at this fucking place. Can you see? Sh don't ever shoot near a window. There's a radio and a mini bar. Everything's, like, mid-century modern. Like, look at that headboard. I can't deal with this place right now. The color palette here, it's, if I, if I was a fucking hotel room, I would be this place. Let's look at, I mean, that's not the best view, but there's just such a cool energy here, and I'm so into it. I'm so excited about um, the shoot tomorrow, and I hope that you guys Stay tuned and watch everything that happens. We're going to be doing an Instagram live, I think, and um, a story based on what's happening tomorrow. Oh my god, look how cool this place is. 
because I can't deal. It's fucking rad. It's in the cold breeze good, so. And I got props for bringing my own <laughs> stevia to the coffee shop, so. That's Nashville. That's the hotel room. It's the Thompson in downtown. Stay here. It's fucking rad. So, see you guys later. We're in Nashville and we're in the Rainbow Room Lounge and there's five music playing. And Nashville's so fucking cool. This is our photographer, John. Hi. 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 I have a group text with my buddies and we always send, or pretty much just me because I'm the only single one. Um, like, I'm the only single one. I just send um, Tinder gems. So I just came across this one. I was like, boys, I'm gonna meet my wife at Castro. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Who wants to be that girl? That was yeah. him. No way. Tinder nightmares? Yeah, Tinder nightmares. You made some, some money off that? I had a shit little... chip we have had in like a year and a half after I ate a shit ton of fried chicken oh, I mean not a shit ton I'm exaggerating I didn't eat the best that I've ever eaten but I didn't eat like poorly but I'm dairy intolerant and I had me a good seven to ten bites of like one macaroni at a time mac and cheese which was fucking delicious because it's like Nashville but this is delicious and I know I'm gonna be bloated tomorrow and I'm gonna look like shit I'm gonna have gas but hopefully they said that they had a badass gym here I want to set my alarm for four o'clock in the morning and go run maybe I'll probably fucking get up and be in a food coma slash hangover and be like, fuck it, I'm not going. Also, finding like anything to watch in a hotel is really hard because like the channel menu that they give you only does so much. Fuck. I just wanted to like record this fucking moment of me eating this chocolate chip cookie. Because it's fucking delicious. And I just wanted this to be part of the video because it's very important to film this aspect of my life. Killer brew coffee. I love your fucking cookies. It literally could have been cardboard with chocolate chips on it and I would have been excited about it. I'll probably eat all three of them, but I digress. 
Anyway, good night. Day one in Nashville. Tomorrow's a shoot. I talked to our stylist and um, she, oh my God, Milka. Milka's our stylist. I'm not going to give you her last name. But she's Miranda Kerr's personal stylist. And Miranda Kerr's perfect. But um, she found this like really, really rad retro fur jacket. And then she kept going and found this acid green fur coat. And it's so amazing. And then she found a teddy bear fur. And it looks like someone kind of took like random Fendi color spray paint to it. And it's like the most perfect thing I've ever seen. I love her because milk is perfect so at least tomorrow you'll see some rad clothes that's I mean that's what every girl wants everyone wants to see Gucci and Fendi and Chanel and it's all going to be there tomorrow so mm. I heard your chocolate chip cookies and clothes what more do you want Thank you. Sure Where's almond milk over here? Thank you. Gotcha. The one that says almond. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Have a good one. I'm like, he had a key. He came to my room with a key that worked. So I talked to a guy last night. He didn't seem like he had much to say about it other than like, come down in the morning, we'll get you a new key. And then it came down. It's the same guy I talked to last night. So it was like, I'll have a manager contact you. But, yeah. He's got your number, Greg. You're gonna take care of him? I'm thinking we gotta get some, some cops. I want a sweet tonight. So we're at the venue that we're shooting in. The first half of the day is gonna be indoors. The second half of the day is going to be outside, but it's slightly damp in Nashville today as all things Midwest, but check out the stands floor. It's real honky-tonk heaven. This place is so cool. Nashville's just rad in general, but. So hopefully this thing turns out rad. I'm gonna jerky. Um, I'm always eating, but let's see what happens. This place is cool. I feel like I'm really bad at vlogging. People are giving me shit already, but it's okay. Um, so this is the, the area that I think we're going to shoot in, and it's the stage area of the bar. It's called Nashville Palace in Nashville, but it's pretty amazing. Um, there's like a wall of cowboy boots, and there's the stage. Yeah, but it's really, really, really cool. Obviously, Nashville has probably the most neon signs of any city I've ever been to, other than Las Vegas, probably, but I digress. It's, this is a really, really, really cool bar. Yeah, so that's the second half of the area that we're shooting in.
one of JJD. It went really well. We were in a bar called um, Nashville pa Palace, Nashville, Nashville Palace. And now we're on Broadway, which is obviously the famous like neon sign street in Nashville where all of the live music happens. And it's gonna be part two of the shoot. And I don't think I'm allowed yet to post anything about from a legal standpoint. So I wanna ask about that before. So I might not have you know the shoot in this video, but at least you can kind of see where we are. This is a, like a bad um, example during the day because this place is like lit up like the fucking Fourth of July and Christmas combined at night. Um, but yeah, this is where we are. This is the trailer. We're about to get catering done for lunch. And um, yeah, outside. So I'll keep filming and see if there's more. And P.S. it's hot and humid as fuck in Nashville. Just so everyone knows that. So we got done with the photo shoot and I there's an Urban Outfitters around the corner that's like really, really rad. It's like the New York City kind of one. It's in this um, loft style-esque kind of warehouse building. And I'm hoping they have some rad shit. So we are about to go to dinner. We're gonna go to the rooftop bar first. Um, the shoot went well. It went great. Our stylist did a kick-ass job with the fur. The fur turned out super lovely. Um, Jesse was awesome. The place that, the venue that we shot in was really cool. Um, when we went out to Broadway, it was a little hectic, a little cray-cray, and I mean, but we killed it in the morning and it was great, so. Um, I wanna eat better tonight. Like, I fucking ate like a, moron yesterday and like I, I swear to god so fats I don't want to like I don't fucking want to talk about this right now because it's like not part of the national video whatever <laughs> I'm starting to be a vlogger go forth thank you <laughs> you're starting to be a vlogger yeah new, new thing. I'm just trying to get Chanel to give me free shit all the time thank you okay you saw her today with her like 2.8 million followers. I feel like, like it's how does she do that? I'm, it's 2017 and my name starts with a K. Like I'm already there, right? Yeah. I just have to marry a Kardashian and I'm in. <laughs> Sup, Rob? I know you and Black China split up, but I'm single, so come on down. I think it's a solid plan as far as I can tell. I still don't have to pay for accessories or clothes. Like everything else I'll pay for, you know what I'm saying? That's really wonderful. Line. Yeah. Duck? Fried chicken or pork chop? I'm gonna say fried chicken. What a natural answer. Thank you. I feel like I didn't grow up in a place where I'm allowed to eat this. <laughs> you know? like, this is like way above my pay grade. <laughs> Such a good discussion, yeah. Damn. Like where I come from. That's that's what I'm doing. Like you said? Guy, you said? Alright. It's very helpful. Thank you so much. I feel like I'm gonna break it. <laughs> <laughs> you got to I got like a tomato. So our meal tonight is heirloom cherry tomatoes, whipped buttermilk. You know if you eat that, you become a woman, right? Just so you know. So be careful. It's just it's so, that's so cute. I don't want to like touch it. Like some sous chef like spent like 15 minutes. Yeah, just like perfectly putting in the baby leaves. Like it's so. Yeah, 
your little baby plate, please? Thank you very much. It's probably that small, be careful. I can't eat buttermilk, so if anybody wants one of these. Oh, it's buttermilk? Yeah. I'm dairy intolerant. I'm lactose intolerant. I can't eat it. Are you going pork chop? I am too. Are you really? Pretty much. Pork chop? It hit me when I turned 30, I just got really sick all the time, so I had to stop, but I'm tired of No, it's very good. I'll every once in a while I'll do butter, but like even butter. Like, Does it make you blow and feel like an awful human being? Yeah, for like an entire day, I'm hungry and I'm full of Hey, food. you get me. He like gives me shit all the time. I can't have dairy. I live in the South too. That's what happens. You can't have a buttermilk in LA. Everyone's like, oh yeah, that allergy. Oh, we get it. Here they're like, you are get it? You're in a restaurant that the waitress will be like, lame as fuck. What do you want? You can have some vegetables if you like. No, you've been doing this entire time. It's like not worth the feeling that you have after you eat dairy. It's like the worst. Flounder? Yeah. It's a. Order it. Really white, flaky fish. It's really good. Flounder on the side. How much have you ever seen Little Mermaid? What is this? Yeah? It's like a little tiny tomato with like caviar. I've been here five minutes and I'm already in the Okay, for him. So, oh, I like that one. Yes, that's Mallory. That's scary. Yeah. He's a scary guy. They're beautiful. For sure. Yeah. Him and, um, who did, um, like, um, beautiful images for hours. This might as well be the movie's so like, um, um, Say hi, Drew. Hi, Greg. Who's this? It's just for a vlog.